Hi, I'm Megan and I'm from Bellevue East High School. Represent, represent! And this piece is called Remedies. I can still remember the way the awkward silence hung in the air, sitting there like a big giant cliched elephant. My parents don't say anything. They don't want to get involved. This is what dinner at my grandfather's house is like. I make the six hour drive several times a year to have him tell me what I should be doing with my life. He asks me what I want to major in in college. When I say poetry, he is disappointed. He says there's no money in that. He asks me if I've considered law school. After all, I'd make a great lawyer. Or maybe medical school, he says. Go to medical school, become a doctor become something that actually makes a difference. This is when I cannot take it anymore. I want to tell him when I was closer to death than I've ever been before, it wasn't a doctor who saved me. It was a collection of words all placed in the right way and they all said stay. It was a stranger who never saw me, who never spoke to me, but who knows me, who's felt what I felt, who wasn't saved by a doctor. Not all ailments come in the form of viruses or bacteria. Not all sicknesses take the time to shut down your organs, to cripple your legs. Some just go straight for your mind. And I don't need a lawyer to tell me that a doctor can't cut that away. I'm tired of taking pill after pill for things I know how to solve myself with paper and a pen. I don't want to become something. I want to become someone. I want to write something that makes you want to wake up tomorrow that makes you believe there will be tomorrow. I want to show you not all remedies come in the form of a bottle of pills or beer or bleach. Some are small and quiet and room shaking and life altering and enough. I'm not looking for money and neither are you. We all just want to live our lives in a way that we can look back and say, maybe I never really knew what I was doing but you can't say I didn't know why.